Okie dokes, we're going to make a praying mantis mask. So you need your two pages that look like this. I'm going to use these crayons. I love these crayons. Here I've told moms or helpers or dads how to do it, what to make. This is where you're going to stick the antenna. This is where we've made holes for your elastic. And mums, you'll see it, it's shiny and smooth at the back. We've put sticky tape to reinforce it. So your first job is to cut all the way around on the outside and then mums, can you cut out that circle? So here we are. That's the first job that you're going to do. Cut out on the outside and then mums or helpers. If you're in grade R, I want to teach you how to do this little circle. You kind of pinch it over there and you give it a snip. Natalie, Tegan, I'm sure you can manage this. And then you can poke your scissors in and you cut on the dotted line. But for some of you, it might still be too difficult to cut. Can you see how I'm turning the paper? So that's how you get into a little space. It wasn't very neat, but I'm sure you'll be able to neaten it up. Then here, you need to cut these two big R's out, compound R's. Adults, you can cut out these sections and Great art children, I'm sure you'll be able to manage to cut out the antenna. The other children, I think the adults can cut for you. And here they are. We have two eyes and two antenna. So let's put our mask together. First of all, it's like a puzzle. We need to see where they're going to fit. Because is this correct? No. Let's have a look if that is correct. There we are. There, this is starting to look like a... Praying mantis? I think so. So I put glue very carefully. Don't put glue on mum's table. Very slowly and very carefully. Put the glue down. Did you see I wasn't holding the lid in my hand? And I glue it ever so carefully. If there's a little space like that, it doesn't matter. Mum can cut it more if you would like her to. Then I can put glue on here. Put the glue down so I have two hands to work with. There we go. Rub it. Now, those crosses are for the antenna. Now, do you think that looks right? Or do you think that looks better? There we go. Now, I only need glue on this bump and a little bit up. So watch what I do. Anchor holds the glue. Now, I can just rub it and a little bit up. I let the glue go. And our position. Think carefully about the angle that you want your antenna to be. Rub it like that. There we go. And now, now that we've glued the eyes on, the holes are covered again, mums. But you can just use something sharp. I haven't got my, there we go, I just used a sharp pencil to poke through. So now I've got two little holes and you've got a piece of elastic to thread. Thread it through. Maybe you need something to push it through with. There we go. Double knot will work well because we're going to see all these little praying mantises running around looking for yummy bugs to eat. And then over here, push it through. Pull it, and then you have to make it to fit your child's head. So it is a little bit hard for children to manage all by themselves, and they will need you to help, but when you're finished, you'll be so excited to see your little praying mantis. Do you want to see what I look like? Let's have a look. There we go. I'm the praying mantis. I'm going to look for slugs and bugs and butterflies to eat. Yum yum. See you later alligators in a while. Crocodile.